Well, good morning, folks. We're over here in Cos Mill, Mexico. And you see the lighting, how it changed that till greening? You know, till greening kind of effect with the clouds and the mist. I didn't do that. That was the, the sun or a sun simulator. I don't know. But it's like it just lights up and then it turns back off. I did dehaze it, but see, that's that's what I see when I first started recording this. I'm not I'm not doing the lighting on that. That's the cameras. I time lapsed it. Um, I showed you a little clock. I'm gonna start showing you the clock on the right. Um, but I time lapsed this thing, and just watch. Uh, when we get to the end of this video. I'm gonna be installed in, but there's a few things I'm gonna show you in between. And the installed in material took me four tries to get up. I mean, literally, it disappeared out of my computer a couple times. And no exaggeration, I've been talking to Douglas quite a bit. He's been seeing quite a bit of stuff. I'm going to show you a Douglas film pretty soon. But Nepicity, blue, uh, Big Blue, Neverbrew's coming over a lot right now. Uh, the Stalden footage at the end is mind-blowing. Warning, if you don't want to wake up, please leave within... Uh, you're safe until about 24 minutes into the video chats open if you need prayer we will pray for you and please keep your um, aggressive comments to yourself or nasty you know type stuff we don't we don't care about that here I mean it's not gonna offend us too easy but uh, you will get jumped on and preach that <laughs> see how it just turns on turns off this is time-lapsed so keep watching to the end uh, I'm gonna put a bunch of different music on to match the uh, the skies here and Enjoy the journey. I'll be back.
I like that music. You see how those planets are just stacked up? I didn't see this the first three times I edited this video. So I'm actually doing a better job editing a video on this time around than I did last because I'm seeing more stuff. Keep watching. Put some music up. Got Jesus. I'm serious. Got Jesus. Pasquale got Jesus. Malibu got Jesus. Harrison got Jesus. I know he does. Ha <laughs> ha!
I'm back. How's everybody doing out there? Well, it's pretty sobering. I'm not trying to bring any fear. I'm not fear mongering. I'm not foreign fearing or whatever they call it. I'm just showing you what I'm seeing. And all I'm doing is trying to show you um, to wake your mind up to how big this up. Now, remember, we're 78,000 feet up. So when we see the sky eclipsed from Alaska, you know, we're only like 800 feet up or 1,000, 1,200 feet up sometimes. But here we're like, eight, we're in the Alps. So right now you're watching this. This is the final run on this. And so it was day after day. I've seen different things. I took the best shots and I just put it into a slow motion form where you could just see one day after another. If I actually zoomed in on the date and time, you'll see it. Uh, a lot of this is still up. You could probably go see some of the last few days that I clipped. So this is from January 2nd until the present time, you know, of course. Uh, it took me about four tries to get this up. I literally was taken out of my computer twice. Douglas was a witness to that. I got mad a few times, called him up. <laughs> but check this thing, how that pink and yellowish looking rainbow forms on the circle of the planet. Now there's multiple planets here. I want to say that. It's just hard to capture them and put a name on all of them. But um, <clears throat> I dehazed it. So everything got a little bit darker, like if you turn the gamma down, but it's a little bit more than turning the gamma down and the contrast. And if the if that was just blue sky in the day, putting a rainbow out with the curve day after day for a whole month, I'd say, okay, but, you know, the blue sky, how does it cover the sun? How does the blue sky act like a cloud? Um, it's not a blue sky. It's a planet. So you see it, uh, the edge of it right here, the biggest. This is this is planet looks like it's so close because we're so high up. It actually is pretty close, but remember, it's in between the solar system. The solar, solar system is spinning in front of the sun, so we get eclipses of the different planets. Um, Douglas has been calling me, and he's getting some insane stuff. So one of the videos I do next is going to be a Douglas video because it's stuff like this, but you can see four or five planets in it so clear. And we're trying to get him an upgrade on his camera, so if you want to donate to the Douglas Fund, let me know. We're going to try to get him an all sky cam, or a bloom sky cam first. If anybody's got anything on the bloom sky cam, let me know. Or any free cam he can get as a weather channel, as a weather cam. Sometimes they'll give you the weather cam so they can put it on your house. So anyways, uh, we're going to work on that. <clears throat> try to come 24-7 from Buffalo. But check this out. See how it's forming? I can't make this stuff up, guys. I just caught the picture, enhanced them a little bit, and that's it. You're seeing what these people see. You can clearly see the shadow going to the right bottom. The sun's coming in. You can clearly see the blue. Now you got the pink rainbow, which is phenomenal. Let Dr. Albers do a video on this. Anybody want to do a video on this video? Go for it. If you're from Samuel Hoffman, go for it. Take pictures. Um, you know, I, I go with the Samuel Hoffman because... I see the planets the way he lays them out. So, and people call me Antichrist. That's okay because they spoke worse of Jesus. They called him Son of Satan. Um, so I don't. I don't care about all that. That just. That's like a badge. That's like getting another stripe. You know, no big deal. It's the way it rolls. It's the mark of the beast thing going on out there. You know, Satan's marking people before the mark of the beast even comes. So you know, either part of that crowd or you're part of the crowd that believe in God. So when I say watch and pray, I mean. You know, don't freak out. Just start praying. Praying for your loved one. But pray for people around you. Anyways, folks, uh, you got about six minutes left on this. And uh, have a blessed day. Sorry if this is a drag watching it. But I'm just showing. This is like my hobby now. Jesus loves you. I love you. My wife loves you. She knows I'm crazy. You guys know I'm crazy. So enjoy the show. I'll be back. All right. God bless. God Jesus.